The MLT 3400 from Snap-on takes bench grinding to a new height. But Alan, it looks like a bench grinder. Maybe it's not a bench grinder. What is this tool? Dave, it's a belt and disc sanding tool, which basically takes the place of any common bench grinder, but it does much, much more. It has four separate work surfaces, as opposed to a common grinder, which only has one. It has a platen area here for long, flat objects. You can, you can actually sand the bottom or the sides of any of these types of objects. It has a rubber impregnated contact wheel to take away the vibration. You can actually grind directly off this contact wheel and with 5,000 feet per minute of belt speed, it will actually remove stock five times faster than what a normal bench grinder would, considerably quieter and cooler. It has a free strapping facility here underneath, so the belt will actually follow the contour of a pipe or a round type object, such as a piece of exhaust tubing. If it's cut mm -hmm. and there's a burr on the side, it can actually be deburred, descaled, and a slight angle put on from, from this facility here underneath. There's also a table here, and what's that table used for? Yeah, that's correct, Dave. It's a, a mitre table and bracket. You can actually set objects flat here on the disc to, to, uh, to get to, to set precise angles. The table can actually be angled up or down again to set precise angles great application for welding. Uh, it also comes with a mitre bracket which can be set so that you can get the correct angle for any particular job. It looks a lot like the MLT-100, but what's different about this unit? David basically is exactly the same as the MLT-100, but it's powered with an industrial strength three-quarter horse fan cool motor. So it's basically a plug-and-play unit. It actually comes attached to a board, you pull it out of the box, plug it in, it's ready to go, completely plug-and-play. Oh, that's great. And does it change belts as easy as the MLT-100 did? Yeah, David has all the unique features of the MLT-100. Just simply depress the belt. The belt changes very, very quickly. It also has our quite unique and patented tracking facility here on the side, mm -hmm. which is just a lever up or down to track the belt to precisely where you need it to be. But I notice there's some new belts available for this, and they look like they're made out of Scotch-Brite. Do they go on just as easy? Yeah, exactly, Dave. With our help with, uh, help with our friends from 3M, we have a complete range of Scotch-Brite now. We have from, from very heavy to super fine, um, and exactly the same process. The belts just move on exactly the same, and uh, away you go. So there you have it, the MLT 3400 from Snap-on taking a bench grinder to new heights, putting the bench grinder into the modern era. Ask your dealer how you can take an MLT 3400 out and give it a test spin.